What's going on guys, Rana back here with another After Effects tutorial and in this video I'm going to show you how to create frame pausing effect. Let's have a look. As you can see in this example uh, we have this effect with having a snapshot of this person. We will create this effect and let's have a look another example. As you can see in this example we have this some sort of ghosting effect actually we're going to create both of these effects in the same video so before i start of this video i want to let you know that uh, we need a footage without background as you can see uh, i have this transparency background i have no background at all so you can access the same raw footage uh, in the description of this video so you can follow along with me so let's get started I'm going to drag my footage into this new comp button after that I'm going to get rid of this green background so select the footage go to effect keying key light 1.2 now select the pick wave and select the green color and boom we get rid of that green color instantly let's turn off this transparency off for a second and go to screen matte and uh, increase clip black and we have this clean edges increase it until we get what we want and clip white we're going to decrease that all right we're good to go so next thing we want to do is uh, actually I want this person to be slow down when he kicks in right about there I like this motion so how would I do that well I'm going to right click on this layer going to time unable time remapping which give us two keyframe so when I at the right spot where I want this person to be slow down I'm going to make another keyframe by clicking here and I'm going to select this keyframe and take this to close to this first one so what's going to happen at this keyframe to this keyframe this footage will go fast and this keyframe to this keyframe this footage will slow down let's ramp preview this so, so you can have an idea Alright guys, let's move on to the next step. So which is we're going to enable frame blending switch. So I'm going to click on this button and uh, which give us frame mix. So I'm going to click again which will give us pixel motion which is pretty much good. And I'm going to enable this switch, frame blending switch as well. To work this pixel motion button right here so next step we want to do is we're going to pre comp this so I'm going to hold control shift and C which pops up this pre comp dialog and I'm going to select the second option move all attribute into the new composition you can rename whatever you want click OK so now I'm going to add pixel motion blur plugin go to effect and preset panel and type pixel everything related to pixel will comes up and uh, we need this pixel motion blur under the time drag and drop on your layer leave it as it is we do not need to mess with the settings after that let's find the place where we want this person to be taking a snapshot like uh, I want right about there so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna hold on control and D to duplicate the layer and I'm gonna trim this from the beginning I'm gonna hold shift and take this right about there I'm gonna trim after trimming the layer top layer I'm going to right click on the layer go to time freeze frame all right after freezing the frame I have this effect as you can see the background is still moving but we have the freeze frame footage in front of the moving footage so that we do not need that thing 
all right we're going to drop this layer at the very bottom let's find the second place where we want our footage to be freeze let's say this frame is pretty much good let's duplicate the top layer again and uh, trim this I'm going to hold alt and press begin bracket to trim that and uh, freeze this frame again time freeze frame after that drop this at very bottom let's find another place let's say this is looking good I'm going to duplicate the top layer again let's trim this alt begin bracket and right click on the layer go to time freeze frame and drop this layer at the very bottom again let's ramp preview this press n to select the region from the end let's ramp preview all right guys now we achieve this uh, frame pausing effect and this effect we have this uh, kind of taking a snapshot of this person let's move on to the our next effect which is ghosting effect so this is pretty simple let's go to your first keyframe uh, where we paused our frame freeze our frame and uh, let's press T to bring opacity option let's make a keyframe of the opacity and uh, move a uh, hold down shift and select your time indicator and go to second keyframe which is right about there and uh, turn down your opacity to zero and uh, select the, this layer and press T again and make a keyframe at the beginning and hold down shift and move your time indicator to the next keyframe and decrease the opacity to zero all right let's select the bottom layer and press T and make keyframe move couple of frame forward and make keyframe to zero all right now select all these keyframe and press F9 to easy E now what we want to do is let's select last keyframe and move a little further all right let's ramp preview this all right guys that's pretty much it I hope you enjoyed this video if you really enjoyed it and you learned something from this video please don't forget to subscribe to my channel because we're going to have more videos like this one okay see you guys and next time Whoa.